Thursday afternoon and welcome to the Now Detroit. I'm Carolyn Clifford. And I'm Joanne Purton. We begin with breaking news and the search for Danielle Stislicki. She's the Farmington Hills woman who went missing last December. Today, more than 100 people were on the ground scouring a wooded park near Plymouth and Newburgh in Livonia. The Now's Jonathan Carlson live off Heinz Park Drive with the very latest for us. Jonathan. Yeah, guys, good afternoon to you. A hot day to search. In fact, a couple of those searchers were told were overcome by the heat. I'm going to step out of the way to show you the entrance to Heinz Drive there. Actually, a truck is blocking it right now, but you may be able to see there's still a police car that's sort of blocking the entrance to Heinz Drive where they were trying to keep people out of that area. But as you mentioned, uh, the search has ended. Nothing found, but searchers didn't come here by accident. Action news was there as a few of the 155 searchers scoured thick brush along the long and winding Heinz Park Drive. They're looking for Farmington Hills woman Danielle Stislicki or any clues surrounding her December disappearance. They were on foot as well as four wheelers. This is the park where the person of interest in her case is accused of attacking a jogger weeks before she vanished. He was recently arrested for that crime and remains locked up. Generally, if people who commit these types of crimes, if they dispose of a body somewhere, it's usually somewhere they're familiar with. Now, the Stislicki family was not out here today. They were watching from afar, and you know the chief obviously disappointed. They uh, didn't find anything of interest here, but he says it's uh, one search checked off the list, and they're going to keep on searching until they solve this case, guys. Got to be so hard for that family, Jonathan. We understand they were out there looking for particular items. Any idea what they were looking for? Yeah, they were looking for a number of items that uh, their uh, detective work has indicated may uh, be on Danielle, uh, may have been used uh, to dispose of Danielle, as horrible as that may sound. We're going to have more on that coming up on Action News at 5 o'clock. All right, thank you so much, Jonathan. We look forward to your report coming up. Joanne?